Welcome back. The last train has made its way from Epping to Chatswood for seven long months, with stations in between now closed as they prepare for the new metro. In the meantime, it's not just train commuters, but also drivers who may feel the pain. Pink buses on patrol between Chatswood and Epping, but already commuters are seeing red. Taking longer? Yeah, take longer. We've been waiting here for nearly six minutes now, but, you know, we have to change and everything. So, yeah, it's a little bit of inconvenience. Who knows, right? State-of-the-art train stations along the line shut for seven months from today. Last night, enthusiasts enjoyed a ride through the tunnel for the final time. Now, roads, the only option. You know, those station link buses are there to serve everybody and, of course, the additional trains. Three stations are being closed along the link Macquarie Uni, Macquarie Park and North Ride. Trains replaced by 110 buses per hour during the peak. Bear with us. Uh, this is going to be testing times. Making way for much anticipated metro upgrades. Yeah, I'm looking, I'm too excited. Buses to Macquarie University. The local roads bracing to buckle. Extra traffic and bus detours adding at least 10 minutes to the commute. Parking clearance areas have been created to cope, but some promised upgrades and bus lanes are missing. We did as many as we could before the operation. During the shutdown, glass safety barriers will be installed on platforms, signal systems upgraded and the new metro trains tested with the promise that ultimately capacity will greatly improve. Well, a brand new metro train for this part of Sydney is going to be phenomenal. We've just got to get there. No pain, no gain. Serena Andaloro, 7 News.